So you've taken the T7, you've seen your scores, you want to improve your score. To do that, you need to look at this, topics to review. Take reading, for example, 39 questions. Now on the T's website, it says 45 questions, but six of those are unscored. 45 minus six, that's where the 39 comes from. Now, what do these numbers mean here? 15 questions came from key ideas and details, R.1. The student got 80% of those 15 correct. 80% of 15 is 12. Moving down here, 88.9% of nine, round it off, that's eight. 86.7% of 15, that rounds off the 13. Add those up, the student got 33 out of the 39 questions correct. Divide that, convert that decimal to a percent, that's where the 84.6% comes from. But listen to this, this is important. Remember here, the student got 12 out of these 15 correct. That means they got three wrong. One, two, three. Those are the three topics to review. Student got eight out of nine correct, which means they missed one. This is the one topic to review. And you guessed it, 13 out of 15 right a moment ago. They missed two, there's the two topics. This applies to all the subjects. Take note, math has two sections, M.1 and M.2. 38 minus four, that's 34 scored questions. This particular student doesn't even mention the first one, M.1. They got all of those questions correct. That's why they're missing the numbers in algebra. However, they do need to work on the relationship between two variables. That's from M.2. As a matter of fact, M.2.3. Head over to bcraftmath.com slash videos. I didn't even type in the whole word relationship, and you can see those topics are here. Now, maybe your score report mentions equations, M.1.4. Search for that word. Search for any topic on your T score report regarding math over at bcraftmath.com slash videos.